this is our work environment in the back of an ambulance, which is limited. What we do isn't in the ER. It's not in a nice, clean environment. Sometimes we're in fields, sometimes we're in mud, sometimes we're just out. We bounce down the road, we're never still. The first idea of ultrasound and EMS was brought to me by Jason Bowman. Most EMS systems that use ultrasound, they save it for trauma. For the city of Keller, we don't run much trauma. We talked about the medical uses of it and how we could add in all the extra things that they do in the ER that's not commonly done in EMS. The most valuable one we've been using it for is cardiac examinations for our hypotensive patients because before we just knew, okay, they're in shock and we could look at a few small things to try to tell what was going on. But with ultrasound, we could tell this is cardiogenic shock, this is septic shock, this is uh, hypovolemia. We can tell exactly what's going on. There's no wasting time. We've used it to check for pneumothoraxes. We've used it to check for triple A's. One of the better things I think that I've used it for is starting IVs. We had a patient who was, like we say, if somebody's doing very bad, they're circling the drain. A lot of things have to happen very fast access for medications to be given is one of our priorities. So on this patient, there were no visible vessels to be able to start an IV on. I grabbed the ultrasound machine and told one of our other paramedics to grab the drill and we'll see who gets one of them faster. We would much rather have a intravenous line than an intraosseous line in the bone because they run better, they're easier to push drugs through and they just work better. I actually ended up beating him in getting that IV and being able to give treatment to that patient faster, which was very impressive to me. I believe that this is the next thing that will help us to do our job better. We've already pretty well mandated it where you have to have it available in the emergency room. I think it should be the same in the ambulance. You make a difference in one patient's life and one patient's outcome, and it's worth all the work. That's what sold me, and that should sell anybody else.